Hey, what's up, YouTube? Master Trifecta here. Happy Saturday. Hope you're enjoying your weekend. Uh, looking forward to UFC 158 coming up next week. One more week. GSP and Nick Diaz. Who's going to win? It's going to be crazy. Uh, but for those that know me, uh, you know that I went to a card show today. Um, there's a, a group called Icons of OKC that's based in the Oklahoma City area, which is where I'm at. They do shows usually about once a month, and they bring in signers. Uh, today we had Reggie Smith. Reggie Smith originally played for University of Oklahoma, but he's now current roster for the San Francisco 49ers. So he was signing today, and tomorrow they actually have Brian Bosworth, who's another famous guy that played at Oklahoma, and he's doing an autograph session tomorrow afternoon. I'm not real big on the card shows because... I collect, I collect basketball cards, but I only collect Oklahoma City Thunder, and all the dealers around here, I understand everybody's got to make money and everything, but the cards are just so overpriced, I can get them way cheaper off eBay, or just from different breakers that I know on Block TV, but um, every now and then, there's a couple of out-of-state dealers that do have boxes, and a lot of the local card shops in my area, they don't even carry MMA. So, I did find an out-of-state dealer, he's an Asian guy from Austin, I can't remember what he said his name was, but he's a really friendly guy, super cool, uh, but he, got, he had a few boxes with him, I felt like I got a pretty good deal on here, I got a, a, a box of title shot, this is from 2010 I believe, this only cost me 55 bucks, I found another dealer who had, he said he's had these since they first came out, these two, these two uh, Leaf MMAs. He only charged me 90 for both boxes because he wanted to get rid of them. He said he's been holding on to them forever. And he, he was trying to get me to buy some of this older UFC. He said I was wasting my money with the Leaf. But I've been breaking nothing but UFC. I just started breaking UFC in 2012. So all of this stuff is new to me. So I know it's deep into this run and it's hard to pull stuff out of here. But... You know, I'm a fan of MMA. I don't buy it just to resell the stuff. You know, I do sell, but I am a fan. So I picked up a couple of those boxes, and I got a box of Top Supreme. This just came out, I think, this week or last week. I, I, I dabble in football, but this stuff looks really sweet. It's expensive. This cost me like $90 for just this box. I don't even know how many hits are in it. Maybe like five hits, maybe. Maybe not even that many. But... I figured I would try a box out that, you know, a box out a bit. But um, let's open this stuff up. Oh yeah, I found a. This is the only single I got. I found this in a dealer's tray. I think this is from round two or round one. I'm not for sure. But this was the only MMA card he had. He had it marked for five bucks. I haven't even looked it up on eBay. I don't even know if it's a good price on it. I do know Diego just won his last fight. So I just picked it up, you know, five bucks. I didn't think it was that bad. I don't have a Diego autograph. But I came up, I didn't even look at it when I was there, but when I came home, I noticed it's an eBay one of one. It's one of 25. So I think that's a pretty decent buy. Five bucks. It's got to be one of his first autos. I'm not for sure what it's worth, but if you guys could let me know, I'd appreciate it. But let's uh, rip some of this new product here. We're going to say the... You want to do the football first? Let's do the football first. No, let's do this other stuff first. That was the most expensive box. Title shot. Do we do MMA? We'll do the MMA. We'll do the title shot. Then we'll do another M uh, Leaf MMA. Yeah, it's so rare for me to ever get to a break product because I'm always buying into products on blog TV. Nothing fancy inside of there. Yeah, the, the reason that I like this stuff is that there's an autograph in every pack. Now, there's a bunch of whammies, and that's expected, but it's cheap. I'm paying like $8 a pack. And I know there's good hits in here, so I don't know. Why not? I like to gamble. Let's see what we got. Oh, boy, I'm going to have a lot of base. I just realized that. Base for days. 
But uh, just let's see here. We got a Josh Koscheck, Guy Mesger, Hermes Franca, Jamie Varner. Oh, well, how about that? I wasn't expecting that. Ariane Celeste. That's got to be worth it. I'm, that's got to be worth a little something. Damn, Ariane is stacked. She is such a dirty girl. That's not numbered or anything. But yeah, wow, that's sweet. I'm happy with that. Christoph, whatever his last name is. Uh, whatever. Takaya Hashi. <laughs> I'm going to be slaughtering these names. Wow. This one feels thick. Oh no. We'll save that for last. Okay. We've got Jake Shields. Ben Henderson. James Massero. And Dan Hornbuckle. I have no idea who that is. Base, base, base. Goldie! Goldie! That was probably the height of his pain pills right there. That's why I was smiling. Man, I'm not even going to review the base. We just want autos. Anthony Engine Okani, Dan Hornbuckle, that's the auto I just got. Masaki, Mama and Kalos, Dan Miller. Of the Miller Brothers, AJ might want that. Dan Miller. Crush us, Guy Mesger, base, base, base. Golly, I'm gonna have so much base. Looks like we got a conviction on the back. Dave Peely Herman, Chris Liebman, Dan Miller, Gono, Pride Fighter, Akihira Gono. Pretty cool. Jimmy Bonner, Magdanzig, Conviction. Gina Carano, is she going to come back to UFC or is she just going to stick around in Hollywood? Crazy. Uh, Brammer, Big Nog, Chase Gormley, Hermes Franca. Did he get caught doping? It's been a few years since I've heard anything out of him. John Jones, Kevin Randleman, boy, I think that's my favorite card, Ariane, you dirty girl, Natasha Wicks, she looks like some 80's penthouse Centerfold model or something. Interesting. Kristoff. Masanori Kanihara. Wow, followed it right up with the base. Big Country. Jeremy Stevens. It's a name I haven't heard in a while. Randy Torres, Takayashi, Randy Couture, Mike Swick, Rob Kamen, Junior Dos Santos, Fedor, Emilienko, and Brock Lesnar. This is the one that I thought felt heavy, but who knows. I don't even know what kind of hits are in this product. Looks like another auto. I don't think it's... Christoph, Hitomi, Mike something, Frank Mir, Dave Pee Wee Herman. So, King Mo, whoa, King Mo's in this, huh? 
Well, at least we got an Ariani. Surely the Ariani takes care of the cost of the box, I think, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what the value of any of this stuff is. Let's go for title shot. Yeah, as you can tell, I'm not as fast as those other guys, but I'm working on it, folks. No box topper or anything. I don't know if they have box toppers. There's nothing in there. I don't know if these are set up all towards the top or just mix them up. Code cards! Who wants my code cards? Somebody's collecting them, aren't they? Base, base, base. Got a UFC contenders insert. Got my first Matt Relic. Hey, it's one of my PC fighters. Ken Velasquez. I'll take that. That's him beating the shit out of Brock Lesnar. Fun day. Yeah, if you guys see any hits or anything in here, I'm only looking for hits. Not too keen on the base or the gold borders or whatever. I don't even know what the number cards are, so if you see anything, just holler. Whoa! I lost my camera there on you guys. A Randy Couture insert. Rampage Jackson. These packs are so much easier to open. Pretty nice. First auto is Palahares. I'd say that's probably a whammy. So there's a lot of inserts in this. Should have one relic and one auto left. Insert to our Sylvia. God, these packs are just so easy. So easy to open. Looks like all inserts on that one. Code cards for days. Oh, oh, there we go. Can't complain with a rock. Uh, oh, wow, what's crazy? I'm happy. There we go. So we should have... Another relic in here. Dan Hardy. It's like another base pack. There's a cane insert. I already got that one. Somebody gave that one to me free. Brock Lesnar insert, Carwin. I wonder if I'm passing up hits and I just don't know it. I'll just go check later. I, I don't know the comp what the one on ones or anything like that look like. 
Well, one of these last two should have our last hit in it. Gold cards. So I believe. Yeah, it's in here, it looks like. It looks like it's a champion card of Sean Shirt. First time I've ever seen one of those cards. It's not numbered or anything. Yeah, I guess that's pretty sweet. Can't go wrong with a Hoist Gracie autograph. Let me get some more music on here. Just take me a brief moment for you guys. Have something to listen to. Well, I'm having a heck of a time here. No, no box top or anything, not sure. No, nothing down there. Wonderlay. Man, is this the same duel I got the other day? The Tomi Akano and Takiao Hakashi. Interesting. I have no idea who those ladies are, but Wow, I got Fedor and Brock lined up in that other box too. I just want you to know if you bought into my Diaz and GSP Raz, you're getting a lot of base. Jamie Varner. Not bad, I guess. Brittany Palmer, you dirty girl. Gerald Harris. The auto there. The Dean and Mean Keith Jardine. It's another duel. Marcelo and Acacio. So that's two duels in one box. Holy shit! Holy shit! GSP to 50. Man, I'm going to have to go back to that card show and rub it in their faces. They were giving me so much shit for buying this bu those two boxes. They're like, they couldn't understand why I could buy... They just couldn't understand why I could buy the Leap MMA when the UFC was so much better. So, yeah. 
ninety dollars so far those two wow holy shit wow that makes it all worth it right there GSP Auto I'm happy Natasha ooh penthouse penthouse centerfold centerfold auto Johnny Brown, you want that, buddy? She's lusting for you, dog. Wow, GSP auto. I was not expecting. I didn't even know GSP had autos in this. And well, we got two mirrors now. AJ, buddy. We got Jim and Dan Miller. I know you want them, buddy. Let's trade. You know I want your GSP redemption. So yeah, well, that's awesome. Well, yeah, well, happy with that. Definitely the three hits. We got the uh, the uh, GSP auto to 50. Looks like that's all over the place. We got the Ariane Celeste. And we got the Hoist Gracie. So that ain't too bad. That ain't too bad. Now, let's see what's in the Supreme. Like I said, I only dabble in football. Sweet little box here. Looks like five hits, maybe. Okay, we got a Marshawn Lynch, Rob Gronkowski, that's the 15. Should I be able to get that one to sell? And my auto. Holy shit, Alshon, Alshon Jeffrey, one of one. <laughs> yeah! That's got to be some money right there. Wow! One of one. Alshon Jeffrey. The card on the back is a Larry Fitzgerald. Oh, hell yeah. That is that is sweet. Sweet, 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 sweet. So, yeah. Definitely had a good day at the card show. The card show, you know, thanks to Icons of OKC for hosting the event. Um, you know, check them out on Facebook. I'm not for sure if they have a direct website, but they are on Facebook. It's Icons of OKC. So definitely check them out. Look me up on Twitter if you're interested in trades or buying any of the stuff you saw in this video. You can hit me up at Twitter at twittercom trifecta. And I'm also available on Blog TV. But yeah, Ariane, hope you have a good weekend. Thanks all. Later.